idea for the Wall of Influence came from uh, the 100 Women Who Care group. Uh, it's a donating group. And I just got to say that uh, they have been a great inspiration over the last number of years since we've had them. And this is just another example of how they plug into our school and have given us some really good ideas. Yes, yeah, so I was a member of the 100 Women Who Care uh, who came up with this idea and brought it forward to us. The wall was created uh, in response to um, some friends of the school who challenged us, actually they really urged us to be more transparent about the current financial struggles that the school is having. And um, they talked to us about all the different things that they're thankful for at the school and their idea was why don't we give people a chance to when they send a gift to express what they're thankful for. When I think of the Wall of Influence and Honor, and kind of where that title came from, when I think of the word influence, I think of the uh, people and events in our lives that have shaped us, that kind of make us who we are, they influence us. And the Wall of Influence, uh, when you see it, has a number of people who have shaped us over the years. Uh, and they, they're from our school community. So uh, the, the whole Wall of Influence is just, and it's really just a partial picture of all those who have influenced us uh, here at JCS, and, and we want to honor them for their names on there. I've been emailing back and forth with Jane Erickson, Leverett is her last name now, so it's in Texas, and that's been fun. You know, she said, oh, I have so many good memories, and so much was built into my life because of the school, and I want other kids to have the same opportunities. I would never want people to not have that opportunity. On the wall, there's all different um, names from people that are current families, that are current grandparents, but there's some names of people whose kids went to the school in the 1970s. Uh, so there's a lot of different names. There's the name of every person who's contributed is on the wall, and some of them have sent in what they're, what they're thankful for. A lot of them have mentioned teachers um, or uh, people who were here in the past. Uh, one of the bricks is um, in honor of Mark Tobby, who uh, the school honors in the fall. Um, but Mark was a student um, who attended here, who passed away when he was a student here. And um, his parents sent um, a gift in his honor. So it's all different kinds of people um, and things that people are thankful for that they're expressing on the wall. Response has been tremendous uh, to the letter that we sent out. I, I think it's a direct um, it's a direct result of our obedience. Uh, we really were urged um, by friends of the school to be more transparent about our current financial situation. And the same day that we were urged by these friends in the school, um, there was a devotional that we read in the same day all about transparency amongst um, believers um, who have needs. And so God was really being specific about sending out the letter that we sent out and um, because we're obedient, um, people have responded. And that was God's plan. So we're really glad we were obedient. Um, to date, over $30,000 in gifts have come in. And that's a pretty tremendous response from a letter. So many different people have um, given. It's overwhelming, actually. It's humbling. Uh, when you read the names on the wall, it's, um, it, it's overwhelming and humbling. Those are the best two words I can think of to describe it. Um, people are thankful for the school. It's because it's God's school. He built this school for a reason. He sustained it for a reason for years and years. And um, we know that his plan is for the school to continue. So um, just a tremendous thanks to everyone who's responded. Gifts have ranged from $25 to ten thousand um, dollars it's, it's been all over the place um, and and that's what God asks us to do he asks us to give according to our ability and um, when we all respond that way then it, it it works in his economy so we're just so thankful so the response has been tremendous and I do want to take just a moment and say thank you very much uh, to all those who've given uh, a little bit or a lot the amount of each gift is not important to us so much as that a lot of people have provided. Um, and just so thank you very much. It's a great encouragement to myself and to our school uh, family here to know that our school family is behind us. Mm -hmm.